The Mars InSight lander may have sent its last picture to Earth. Its solar panels are almost fully covered with dust and it's almost out of power. When these things happen with Mars landers and rovers, people ask a lot, why aren't there windshield wipers on the solar panels to wipe off the dust? First, Mars dust does not behave like liquid and it also behaves differently than Earth dust. It's stickier and it's charged, so the atmosphere actually pushes it down onto the solar panels. Wipers might not do the job and they might scratch something. Second, it's incredibly complex to fold these rovers and landers into a launch and entry configuration. Adding wipers into the mix is an engineering challenge to say the least. Plus, uh, extra weight is always an issue. Every ounce matters when you're going to space. Third, more moving parts on a lander means more things that could break. Finally, we get emotionally attached to these landers and rovers, I certainly do, but the reality is they are not designed to operate indefinitely. InSight landed on Mars in 2018. Its primary mission was two years. It's designed to study the interior of Mars we're way past that primary mission duration. But it's not as if like, if the solar panels were functioning, InSight could just run indefinitely. Mars is a hostile environment and the dust is a real problem. It gets everywhere into the gears, inside the machinery, into the instruments. If it wasn't the solar panels, it would be something else breaking down. It's just a matter of time. The bottom line is yes, NASA could probably put wipers on these solar panels, but at the end of the day, dust becomes a problem long after the primary mission is over.